Well, some bad news for boat owners out of northeast Pennsylvania. After the Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission announced it would be indefinitely shutting down electrical service at the Northeast Marina. Those from Northeast, they're concerned that this lack of electricity would lead to the death of that marina due to many boaters not being able to hook up to the power grid while docked before sailing. Erie News Now's Tom Kowalski took a trip out to Northeast to find out more. Following an inspection last fall, the Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission removed all electrical surface from the Northeast Marina due to faulty wiring. They planned on replacing it with a newer, up-to-code electrical system, but due to supply chain issues, have been unable to get the parts, and the project has been put on hold indefinitely. After several of us slip owners asking questions, uh, it started coming out that maybe it wouldn't be for two, three, maybe four years. Jake Sander, a boat owner at the marina, says without electricity, many boaters would dock somewhere else. The marina would die, and with it, much of Northeast's local economy. It would be like anybody having a cottage anywhere and, and no electricity to it, basically rendering it useless. It's going to be one big blow to the economy here. There's fishermen that come here from all over. They stay in the motels, they eat in the restaurants, they go to the beer distributors, the grocery stores, the pizza shops. Dane Washburn privately operates the marina, running day-to-day -day business. He shares the same concerns as Sander. I have a lot of inventory in the store that, you know, I wasn't planning for this to happen, so then I'm going to have to liquidate or take a huge hit. And Lou Dominic, owner of the Colonial Motel in Northeast, says if not fixed, it would cripple his business. 80% of our summer time income would be the boaters of Northeast. If they would happen to close that down, one of the biggest marinas in this area, it funnels everybody back to the west side where it's so congested. Nobody's happy, and that's why they come up here into these small towns, which is a huge revenue service for this town. Tom Kowalski, Erie News Now.